Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are here in the south of Goa at the beautiful Benaulim area. We are going to be doing a tour for you guys, showing you guys basically our holiday that we are on. So this is my beautiful wife, Sharon. Hi guys. And yeah, so we are going to be showing you guys a tour of our villa. We are going to show you a tour of basically everything that we do here in Benaulim. We are going to go to the beach. We are going to have lunch. We are going to go to like a party in the evening. We are going to show you like like everything possible so let's go and check out this incredible place here in south goa okay guys so we are starting off our vlog from this area here so as you can see we are staying at this area with these beautiful portuguese kind of villas they're not really portuguese but they're inspired by portuguese like they have the windows that look like the portuguese kind of uh, villas and if you see here this is a uh, so beautiful view that we have around here so if you see there's all the buffaloes and everything so this is in the Benaulim area it's like two minutes from the beach of course i'll put the name of this place so if you see there there's like all buffaloes and stuff coming out of the water right now so this is so beautiful typical you know local goa this is what you know everybody comes for so we are staying in room two here so let's go in sharon's inside already so hello let's get a room tour hello guys welcome to the villa <laughs> So Sharon's back in the vlogs and she's going to give us a little room tour. Yes, this is the quickest room tour. So right at the entrance of the villa, we have a full frame mirror here. You can check your OOTD. This right here is a nice lounging area. I think, um, yes, lounging area. And then we have our dining table here. You got a fridge right here. And the best part about this villa we have is a that kitchen. you have your own mini kitchen. You can make your coffee. You can even make a toast because there is a toaster here. And then you can cook your small meals right here. And this is the washroom. I know you don't want to see the washroom. You have a clothing rack here. You can put your bags here and a nice queen size bed. And of course, you can also iron your Close. Clothes here, you know, OOTD is so important. Let's show the best part, which is your favorite part. Yes. Oh. In three, two, ta-da! Oh, we have a washing machine. Sharon should be so happy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sharon loves you know washing. Me. I love washing machine because <sighs> I like to wash the clothes every day whenever me and Moses travel. So we got a washing machine here. So, and this, yes. This is the view of the garden. This Each is the. It has its own garden view, guys. So this is the villa that we are in, super nice here. My and clothes are matching. Yeah, and if you see around, these are the other villas that are here. And of course, there is like a pool in the other side. Okay, guys, so just before we go for lunch, I'm just showing you guys the pool that is here. So our room is literally there, but we came around just, we are going to walk to the beach and have some lunch. But this is the pool area, so beautiful, right? And you have all these beautiful houses all around. So yeah, let's go to the beach and have some lunch now. Okay guys, so we have a mini pond here. Is this a pond? Yeah, it's a pond, I guess. You can see fish, frogs, <laughs> mosquitoes. <laughs> I didn't think that are mosquitoes, but mosquitoes are in the air. This is like such a beautiful area. And that's like the road to the beach. But I just wanted to it's show so you guys. It's nice. Like the houses are, I mean, the villas are colorful. Yeah, I so. Like they're like so Instagrammable, like you can click so many photos. Instagrammable is not actually a word, is it? I don't think so. Anyway, so yeah. It's Instagram worthy. Instagram worthy, <laughs> yeah. So if you see why I was saying the Portuguese thing is because of these um, murals or whatever they have here. And that's the little gate going towards the beach. So we didn't want to go like super far. Yeah, so we so are going to go to Southern Deck, uh, which is uh, a friend of ours restaurant which you saw in my previous vlog before i think you have to pull the gate in okay guys so we are back at the southern deck i know i showed you guys like a full tour of the property before but yeah we are just so hungry we're having uh lunch here so we are going to go and sit at one of the tables here so we're probably going to sit i don't know where we're going to sit hi hi how are you so yeah uh we are sitting somewhere but let me just show you like around but if you want to see like the full tour of the property you can check like my previous vlog okay we'll sit here so yeah eight is a good number 
so it here that's like the bar area there and there's like a lot of people here so sharon's hungry as well so <laughs> not hungry <laughs> okay so anyway let's uh, sit down relax uh, get uh, some drinks and then we'll get food and show you guys the whole experience of what we get and then we are going to go to the beach as well so yeah let's get our drinks first Okay guys, an update. We have our drinks now. I have my lemon soda without any. I look so <laughs> exhausted. I am so exhausted. It's pretty hot today. So I'm completely like fully drenched with sweat. So cheers guys. We got a nice chill corona beer here. Cheers. Baby. I'm just so thirsty. So you know our holiday is starting off well i just like i called up somebody to rent a bike and our bike's going to come in like a few minutes so just before that we are going to of course i'm not going to drink and ride i'm just going to keep the bike here at the room uh, and have a nice beer here shall without drinking most sound like it's drunk <laughs> because i'm so like, tired I'm keep the bike here and in the room <laughs> <laughs> I'm already so tired. So cheers again and let's enjoy our holiday here. Ah. Uh, there's nothing better than a chill beer on a nice warm day here in Goa. You know guys, this is so cute. Look at this mm. shot. It's made of banana leaves. I think so. Wow. Yes. And didn't you what did you order? Lemon soda. No, for food. For food, I want my grass. So Sharon's dieting for some reason. So she's getting like a salad. Uh, I am and not dieting. Okay? <laughs> I just want my grass because the entire week, like I ate all unhealthy foods, honestly. So I need my nutrients from the grass. Grass means salad, guys. I call my salad grass. So I'm getting a uh, steak, chicken steak, because. I just wanted something heavy. I didn't want starters or anything. So we are going to show you guys the food, and then yeah, we'll show you the rest of the day. Is it nice? Mm. Delicious. So nice. So my my lunch has mm. not come yet, so I'm super hungry. But yeah, so nice. let's just show you guys like a close up of the dish here. It looks good. Is it, does it have walnut also? No. What is that? Some it nuts. Is cashew. Oh, it's cashew nuts. Okay, so that's like the local, like specialty which is here. They have the flowers also, which is cool. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm waiting for my lunch. Then Yum. I'm so hungry. I'm so jealous. Mm -hmm. Okay, give me, give me to taste. Any, let me taste what you got. Most of yeah. big guy, so <laughs> yeah, <big>. because. <laughs> mm. Oh, it's crunchy. It's so good. Delicious. Mm. Mm. I'm really enjoying it. The mango takes it to another level. Is that mango? Yeah, it's mango. Mm. It's mango, cheese, pomegranate. Wow. Pretty nice. So if you see around here, there's like a lot of people that have come in now. And just over there is the beach. So you can just like cross the restaurant and you reach the beach outside uh, once i finish lunch i'm going to take you guys outside and show you guys the beach area this is the main benaulim beach and yeah so let's get my lunch now okay guys so my food has just arrived and just to show you guys look at that so i got myself a nice chicken steak uh, with mushroom sauce so let me just give you guys a nice look Sharon's still having her salad here. Just Most to show you. Like, I have my chicken steak. <laughs> or chicken steak. <laughs> I'm looking so, at it. Once you get married, guys, <laughs> life is over. All you have to do is share everything. So, I'm such a kind person. I always, sharing is caring. And guys, if you get married, remember, number one rule. When you're married, never argue. If she says half of the steak is mine, give it because you'll have a beautiful day ahead others you'll have a very bad day ahead <laughs> so rules of marriage okay so this is my steak which i'm having nice grilled steak here uh, these are the mushrooms around this is mashed potato that is more mushroom sauce 
so yeah now let's get uh, into trying the food so first of all let me try the wait i need a fork so yeah sharan's cleaning my fork so i get a nice clean fork <laughs> that's not wrong okay so first of all let's try the chicken it looks juicy it's nice and grilled so this is made on the uh, yeah this is chicken breast of course but it looks super nice it's like the meat is like tender juicy moist uh guys none of these videos are sponsored but yeah so everything is oh, authentic authentic <laughs> always authentic reviews so you get to know the real deal from here in goa oh man that is so delicious oh so there's a lot of rosemary in the sauce with the mushroom so that rosemary taste with the mushroom and the burnt like it has this nice burnt pepper flavor mm so so good the mushroom is so the mushroom nice. is so good i'm quite like i'm sorry <laughs> sharan sharan stealing my food here so as i said don't argue yeah so it looks good the food is tasty oh i i forgot to click a photo of my food <laughs> but yeah let's uh, click a random photo so all my instagram followers are jealous <laughs> guys if you're not following me on instagram definitely follow me on instagram and yeah so so tasty mm. yeah so yeah this restaurant is like very close to the beach is like literally opposite the beach and we like to come here because it's so peaceful and relaxing and it's just next to the beach and the staff are so polite and you know that makes a lot in the difference of a restaurant when you feel the what is that hospitality right yeah yeah so um, yeah <laughs> can you guys hear me munching my food because i have yeah. my microphone on yeah it is probably here or eating but I'm sure you guys have no complaints because you feel nice watching us eat from here in Goa. ASMR. Yeah. So every time there's more and more people coming into the restaurant. If you see around here, there's so many people coming into the restaurant. They have they have swings, which is so nice because a lot of kids like to come here and you know swing around here. There's a bar there, the main bar area, and they have like a pub kind of. party place over here which you can party in the night uh, we are probably going to come here in the night again and show you guys what happens here in the evening but anyway let's now finish our lunch and then go on to the beach okay guys so i just rented a bike just now i got the bike uh, fasino which is like i'm in the parking lot of the restaurant but yeah so he just came and delivered the bike to me and yeah we are going to take the bike today and we are going to roam around and that's basically where we are staying so we got a bike we got lunch but yeah we are Sharon still waiting for me in the restaurant but we'll go to the beach now and show you guys the beautiful banaulim beach here okay guys so we are done with lunch and we are going out of the restaurant now so here is Sharon and an update i'm taking over the vlog <laughs> <laughs> this is me yes and moses we are We're going done. to the beach We're done with lunch. Yeah. Moses told me to take the angle higher. <laughs> so that you know, I am a 4'11 girl. <laughs> so I'm so short. We have to use it like this because we want to get the nice angle of the beach. <laughs> so Sharon's uh, here on the beach after a long time, right? Yes, I so, think it was last year. Yeah. You prefer south or north? I'll be lying if I say. I like north. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, so I do like some beaches in the north, but so, I prefer south Goa beaches because no, hello guys. Yeah. Look at this. How can you not love this? So South Goa is super beautiful yes. and yeah. So do you know where which beach we are and which side is Kolwa? Okay, you know, before this take, Moses gave me an orientation. Yeah. So that side of the beach guys is Banalim beach. This is Banalim <laughs> beach. Yeah. And the next beach 
is it Ser starts with letter S. Sa Serna Batim. Serna Batim Beach. Yeah. And the beach after that is Colva Beach. Yeah. So, so it will take you about 15 to 20 minutes of walk to reach Colva Beach from here. Yeah, so that side is the beach. It's very, very beautiful. Uh, this is like a fishing village. So there's a lot of fishing, fishing boats, boats that are here. And uh, yeah, so let's go onto the beach. Let's walk into the water. It is so nice and relaxing today. Beautiful. See, uncle is We're fishing there. Catch a fish with him. Uh -huh. <laughs> He'll go with the uncle and fish. So, guys, uh, this place, Benaulim Beach, is like a famous fishing village. The sand here has little shells. Shells. It has oh. so many shells. Oh. So, this is like it's little shells. It's quite warm. It's not actually cold. It's quite warm. So, yeah, there's little shells in the beach. Go, here. uncle, go! <laughs> So uncle's like doing his uh, yes. fishing here. So there's probably a lot of fish in this area here because otherwise these are like the local fishermen here. Uncle's a local from here. So yeah, there's like all the fishing boats here. So if you see a lot of our Goa fish comes from this area because this is like a rich feeding spot for fish. And that is the main beach area. There's a lot of people on that side of the beach and of course that side is Kolwa. So we had a really nice lunch. It was super, uh, we had a good time. So now we also got our bike. So we want to go to the market area and show you guys the market area as well. So let's, I, go. let's go. Look at this greenery guys. It's so nice to see this rice fields. It's almost there, the rice. The grains? The grains. Uh, yeah. It the smells grains. so yeah. nice because of the, you know, you can smell the, you know, fresh crops. And yeah, so this is like the inside of the village, the road that is a little uh, away from the main beach area. But this is where we are staying. So we're going to put patrol, guys. Yes. See, I'm pro with this now. I can turn the camera anytime I want. Yeah, so this is ex exactly where we are staying yeah, and we are just putting petrol which is a shop right on the road and after putting petrol we are just going to go back uh, to the room but uh, I'll show you guys a little bit of the market area there while we are putting petrol. So yeah, so we are just here. Uh, I have to put my helmet now because we are going on to the main road. This was the inside road. So let me just get my helmet out and then let's go further on guys. Okay guys, so we are just going down the street here. This is the main market area of Benalim. Of course, the main market was like uh, a little behind there. But just to show you guys, see there's like some Grand Royal Suites this side. And like there's a lot of these small restaurants and shops on this area. There is also like bike rentals and car rentals that you can get on this road. So there's this like, whoa, look at this shop see that shop there guys that is so cool so there's like a full hookah shop like they have like supermarket oh there's a supermarket here should we go to the supermarket okay so we're going to go to the supermarket and yeah get some stuff for the room because uh, we're staying here for a couple of days so we'll just go inside and get some water and things like that so this is a supermarket here but yeah after supermarket, we'll go further and show you guys. Okay guys, so we got some chips and some uh, water to take to the room. Uh, you know, we, we drink a lot of water. Keep hydrated. Sharon and me, we like to drink water all the time. Oh. So I have to put my helmet on now. So Sharon's going to take my cap and take over the camera. So we are on the main road now which is the road which is going towards the beach where we are staying and yeah so this is the cute little chapel here and just to show you guys a few of the places here on the left there's goodfellas this is like a good place for pizzas so they have like this italian menu which is really nice and this is feli feli is like this little bar which is very very chilled out so we are going to probably come there in the evening for a drink or two to Feli. And yeah, so if you see here, there's quite a few nice places on this street. So there's cinnamon. This is a nice place for breakfast, which is uh, cinnamon. They have, of course, they have a big menu for all things possible. But yeah, 
so we are almost back to our room there there's wine store here if you want to go get some alcohol uh, and yeah so this the pavilion pavilion is very good for breakfast uh, as well here so they have a big breakfast menu if you are looking for like a english breakfast the pavilion is good and wow they have tuk tuk here tuk tuk is like a little shop that has all these souvenirs for you know if you are on holiday here you want to buy souvenirs and things like that it's really nice and of course there's just a last few shops here selling clothing and a few of the other items guys so yeah that's it from the market area let's show you something else now okay guys so we made it back to southern deck it was super rainy and we didn't want to get like wet uh, so we came back here because we are like re right next to the hotel and yeah so we're going to have a couple of drinks here still at the bar but just to show you guys the vibe uh, right now there's like so many people that place is completely packed at the moment like there's like lots of people here as well so anyway let's get ourselves a couple of drinks and chill at the bar here so Sharon's all huh? <laughs> yeah so this, this is like the only place that was uh i mean uh available right now so anyway let me get a couple of drinks and then we'll show you the drinks and we'll get something to eat and show you what we eat also it started raining like crazy so we couldn't go down to the other bar we were supposed to check a couple of other bars so anyway let's get some drinks Okay guys, so he's going to make us a cocktail over here. He's making us a special cocktail made with strawberry and he said there's milk in this. I can't believe there's milk in this but there's milk in this. This is a gin based cocktail. So it's like super cool and you know I, I wanted to try something new. He's the main bar man here. So he's, he just said okay I'm going to make you something special. So I was like okay go ahead make something special for us and if you saw in the afternoon we had like these straws this is like super cool so he's going to put some wow that's, that's like a lime slice here okay so sharon's going to get hers next and as you can hear there's a lot of music going on in the background we are going to shift tables there cheers thank you so much yeah so this is a cocktail here let sharon just hold this for a second uh, so I can try it out. Let me just try it out. Wow. I did not expect that. That is completely different. I mean, it, it is so good. I don't know what the name is. I'll just put the name down here when I figure it out. I'll ask him what the name is. Wow. So it has like strawberry kind of... Uh, like my mouth is literally watering after tasting that guys and look at that that is Sharon's drink that just came over here Wow look at that. How cool is that? So what is it? What is the name of this drink? We call it mermaid tonic. Mermaid tonic and this one? Uh, ginger chiller because it has ginger. Oh, okay. Ginger chiller. Chill. Wow, wow. So this is ginger chiller with uh, gin and something 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 and tequila. Okay, so let Sharon try hers out now. Sorry guys, I put the... Huh? So Sharon's trying out hers here, which is the... How is it? Okay, Sharon takes a little while. <laughs> yeah, I, I like Sharon. She pro processes the whole thing before this. Me, my, my brain, it goes straight away. I like it. It's nice. So, so it's very refreshing according to Sharon. So this is her drink. Anyway, now let's get something else. Okay guys, so we made it to the top bar now and we are going to be trying some more cocktails. The owner, he just met me, he said, do you want to try something else? I was like, yeah, why not? So we are trying some more cocktails. We are at this really nice part of the bar. This is on top. So just to show you guys around, this is like the on top area here. So that's the owner, Reimer, here. He's the most chilled out guy ever. <laughs> So we are trying out some more cocktails. I don't know, today is like a cocktail day for some reason. So Sharon's getting, so they have like some bar takeover and like two of the brands have like different uh, alcohols like Grand Morangi and Belvedere. So we are trying both of the cocktails from them. 
I'm eating at the same time as talking, you know, he just gave me this something to eat. So anyway, we'll show you cocktails, we'll show you some more food and everything guys. Thank you so much. So guys, we just got some of the cocktails now. So, which one is which? Oh, this is the clearly twisted. Okay, thank you so much. So, we got the two cocktails here. Yeah, this is Sharon's third cocktail already. I'm not even high, but I don't know which one's whose. Now, which was yours supposed to be? This is the Cosmo. Okay, so this one's mine. Okay, so yeah, so cheers to an another cocktail. This is like our third cocktail now. Yeah, so cheers, guys. Let's try this out. So cheers, cheers. This is your favorite. Yeah. Oh, what was that? My typical drink. This is the Cosmopolitan. Oh man, that is so good. This is like a Glen Orange uh, based cocktail. Super nice, super nice. I could have it in like one one gulp, but it's like super nice. I really like it. <laughs> yeah. 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 So guys, cocktails. You don't drink cocktails like in one gulp. So anyway. <laughs> Yeah, no. because like you know when you're drinking cocktails, you just have to make small, small sips yeah. because it has to last for a long period of time. Not for us guys, like today everybody is giving us different, different cocktails so we are trying out all the different cocktails. So anyway, we are going to order, I've been trying to order for a long time but every time we try to order, somebody else comes and says okay try this cocktail or try that cocktail. So anyway, I hope you don't get knocked out but to a good night here so the place is awesome we are having a good time the band's about to start playing so we have to go and get our food before that so let's go okay guys so we got uh, uh, garlic bread here this is like one of their specialities definitely something you have to try out when, when you come here sorry for the lot of noise around us so garlic bread delicious let's try it out oh, yeah. Delicious, super. Okay, guys. So, okay, guys. So we got some more food here. This is a pizza. This is a what pizza is this? Sharon's like having a good time here. She's absolutely enjoying her time. This is a pepperoni pizza. So look at that, guys. How cool is that? Looks good. Let's try it out. Okay guys, so today is the next day after last night. We had an absolutely incredible night last night. We had way, way too many cocktails and it was absolutely amazing. They also have a nightclub there and from 11 o'clock onwards, it turns into a nightclub kind of thing and it was awesome. The crowd was like so many people. It was superb. So today morning, I got up and I went to the supermarket uh, there are like two, three big supermarkets here and uh, something that I was surprised is like these supermarkets have so much of stuff in them like uh, there's because they cater to a lot of international tourists here they have like a lot of international brands as well as like all these chocolates, foreign chocolates and a lot of uh, really nice things. So I bought us breakfast, I, I mean I bought eggs and things because in our room as you guys saw we have like all of the equipment to cook ourselves breakfast. So we are going to make ourselves breakfast now and yeah so I hope you enjoyed this vlog Sharon's cooking right now but yeah I hope you enjoyed this vlog please do like and subscribe and I'll be bringing you guys lots of other videos from here in Goa. Bye guys.